Hi, this is Lisa. We're about to start week two and I'm sitting here looking at the website and I'm just kind of stunned because there's so many posts. There's so many people saying hello and there are bunches and bunches of blogs and links to blogs in the sidebar in the blog roll. There's a lot going on here and it might seem to be pretty overwhelming. So the thing I'm going to do is enjoy the posts, enjoy other people's posts, but not feel responsible for reading all of them or commenting on a bunch of them. And when I'm feeling overwhelmed, I'm going to go to the syllabus and see what is actually assigned for the week. I think the main idea is that we've got a wonderful community growing here and we can participate in it as much as we want. And there's a lot of people to get to know, and there's a lot of cool stuff going on. And there's people who are posting on any number of things, and they're posting on things they discover, and things they find, and things they think about, and all of that is really cool. But when I get overwhelmed, don't have as much time as I'd like to explore everything, I'm going to take a look at the syllabus, and because that's the key. And if you're going through to get the certificate, as opposed to participating in a less regular way, then we want to make sure that the syllabus is followed to the extent that you try the things that are there, do the readings, do the viewings, and create a post that somehow reflects the activities for that week. Or in some cases, the post is going to ask us to do something specific to uh, create something and post it to our blog. So as long as we're doing that and following along, then all the multiple conversations that are taking place, not only on the Pedagogy First blog, but we've got a lot of conversations going on um, other places as well. We have conversations going on as people post to Digo and they save their bookmarks. We've got the Facebook group. Um, and that's very active as well. And there's people there, some experts, some newbies, who are engaged in various conversations there at the Program for Online Teaching group in Facebook. And that's just great. And you're welcome to participate in that if you want to. And then we've got uh, the videos from the Program for Online Teaching in a couple of different places. And we've even got a Twitter hashtag if you're on Twitter and you want to enjoy that. But again, the heart of it is the syllabus. So when I get overwhelmed, that's what I'm going to stick to.